Uh, it's been a little while. I kind of got lost um, during Christmas break and all that stuff. But getting back to the uh, pedestrian flag holder, and here's concept number three. We had a few others going on. It was really great having that meeting with the city. Um, well, it's been about six weeks or so, but um, you know, the issues of uh, aluminum possibly corroding from being close to the uh, salty snow was a really good point. Beer bottles, beer cans, stuff in there, how to clean it out and so forth. Easy to mount. So this is a whole other variation. It's eight inches by eight inches. We have four art surfaces on it. This is just made out of MDF and I painted it white just kind of to get the idea of what it might look like. Um, I would use a um, material called AZAC. This is a, a plastic PVC material, comes in four by eight sheets. And so it's a, you know, a, maybe a really nice material for this project. And a, a cool thing that came up is that these flags are stiff, and so there's no bottom to this. This is just open in the bottom. It's just a straight shot. It's, it's, it's narrow in that a bottle or can't, can't fit down in it, but it's still got that uh, inside dimensions of seven inches in width. And, and if we stay with these kind of flags, I think you can just throw them in there and have a bottomless, well, it's doing that a little bit. You could. I think it might work. I think it's worth a try to consider just having a slot you drop them in. And, and the, um, so that, that, that's that's the thought on the on the bottomless idea. Um, and then I would a um, mount it I could just open this up. In the field, it, this this last panel would screw on. And so this just uh, I'm just taking off this. I just have it in there with the one screw right now. Let's see if I can get this to pop off. I just painted it. And so, and then this this cap would come off there, and there'd be two of these brackets, and that's it. So in the field, you you bolt it on, and then this attached to this, and it goes like that. Azac glues really well. It comes with its own um, PVA glue or whatever kind of glue it takes to, to glue it together. It can be made to be pretty strong stuff, and it's designed to be outdoors. With this, in terms of printing, we may not a. Um, Want to, we may not want a silk screen, so I don't know if that's going to be a problem or not. I'm, I'm, I'm wondering if we can put on outdoor vinyl um, labels or stickers that would go on the four sides. Um, the, the, uh, it seems like you, you don't want a screen print before you assemble it because it's going to take some, some glue and stuff in the corners to assemble it. So you know, I almost want to put the artwork on after it's assembled. And here, this, this panel could have one artwork on it and then again in the field screw on. So. That's just one crossroads. If we go this kind of direction, if you um, choose to not screen print, but use use a, a printed uh, material. Okay, um, let me know what you think. Thanks.